late to my own live show. You're late. You're late for a very important date. I am. I am. I had to go live in the car on the way there. I've been trying to troubleshoot with StreamYard for the past hour and a half to figure out why I haven't been able to hear you. And I had to do the same thing with Noel. Hmm. And it's just, it's just my, uh, it's just my phone. But anyway, they couldn't fix it. So I went and I bought some, some Bluetooth ear thingies, which feel very weird. They look great. Well, <laughs> thank you. They're like, they're like how, earrings, how you know, I should put how far are you away from uh, the meeting point, your mom's house? The meeting uh, point? Where? Oh, just a couple minutes. Okay. Just a couple minutes. That you was fun last snowing. night. Yeah, it's snowing. Yes. It's it's winter. It's winter here. Yeah. Definitely winter here. here I love it. It's so pretty. Well, I'm gonna I'm it. gonna keep watching the road. So you tell me if people are coming in. Yes, we got uh, we got PCs here. And Hello, PC. It won't, me, it won't let me click comments onto the screen. Oh, uh, that was part of the troubleshooting was to take away your godlike powers. And Doug's here, and Dean Kruger is here. Sharon Delaney, Canadian. That's my babes. Not Sharon. Dean. Dean is your babes. Uh, Evan Owen, Rhonda Lockery, another Dean Canadian. is my babes. Yes. Maggie. Another Hello, Rhonda. Canadian. Let's see. Dawn Wright. She is Canadian as well, Miss I believe. Miss Maggie. There's Valerie Galmish. Valerie Galmish. I have got to get kid with... Uh, with Mr. George. Yeah. George the Antique Nomad, because Maggie's got a bunch of things. Hopefully she still wants them. Oh, I'm sure she will. But he has been a busy, a busy man. I gotta book some time with him so that he can uh, come on with us and take a look see at the stuff this, that uh, Miss Maggie picked. Yes. Um, to have it praised. Lucky Boy is here saying hi, girls. Hello, Lucky Boy. You're new to my channel. Welcome. Um, this is not what we usually do. <laughs> and Dean Kruger is saying that the uh, got to get these Canadians to keep their snow up there. Who's Dean Kruger? <sighs> He's Dean Kruger. I'll tell you about him later. He's my babes, just babes. <laughs> I gotta get him to change his name. Oh dear. There's a, a definite lag between me talking to you, and then when you talk back, it's like your uh, your mouth and your voice aren't really. Up. Yeah. Oh man. Oh, yeah, that sucks. Says new here, new to hear from from Treasure Hunter. I'm pulling into my mom's right now, Julie. So let me let me reload on the Wi-Fi, and hopefully it'll be better. Sorry, we're starting late. I will be right back. That's okay. And lucky. Okay. Well, welcome all the new folks. Let's see, Doug. What are you up to there? Yeah. Hey, you Canadians. Please keep your snow and cold winds up there. <laughs> We'll try, we'll try, but it's not easy. It's not easy. And yes, Maggie, I think that is a good point. It's the buffalo snow and Rochester likes it's like a little like whirlwind that blows across the lake and you get what's called the lake effect, right? That's right. Sharon Delaney, I like the snow too. Like it's not on the street, so it's it's okay driving and it's just on the like the trees and the 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 lawns and everything it looks really pretty i'm looking out my my front window here and it's really nice yes don you go ahead and blame new york new york let's new york we'll blame new york 
Did everybody, all the American friends here, have a happy Thanksgiving? I hope so. Did everyone eat ham and turkey, roast beef, Chinese food? What did you guys have? Tell us. Let's see here. I, it's hard for me to sit here without jam. <laughs> oh boy. There she comes. Yay. Okay. <laughs> Am I synced up now? Yes, you're synced up now, but you know what? Oh, to good. Me, what? To me, you're distorted. And I'm, I want to check with uh, uh, the other peeps. Trish, I don't look distorted. No, no, voice, voice distortion. Teresa Lee, yes. Oh, no. I love my thrift you shirt. Yeah, it just sounds like you've got the mic like right up to your mouth. You know what I mean? Yeah. Uh, let's see what the other people say. If they say something, Jan, ask people if you're, you sound distorted. Peter Piper picked a pack of pip pickled peppers. Peter Piper, I should say something I know. How much wood could wood chuck chuck if wood chuck could chuck wood? Okay, it just, yeah, Rhonda's saying sounds fuzzy. Yeah. Yeah, that's these... And Sharon Delaney is using the term crackly. Sounds crackly. So we got fuzzy. We got crackly. What else we got? I don't like any of these terms. These are not good adjectives. These are not good adjectives. Uh, Evan Owen okay, is saying hold on. it isn't right. The sound isn't right. Okay. 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 Hold on. All right. Taking, taking this out of my ear. Okay. And it said to push the button. And then I'm going to put talk to me. Check, check one. You talk to oh, me. Oh, no. Check, check two. Uh oh. You got those back in. I have to. Um, turn up your volume a bit. How's the sound now? It sounds good. It sounds pretty smooth. Give us a test. A woodchuck could one. chuck all the wood if a woodchuck could chuck wood. It's still a little crackly, girl. I don't know what's going on, but not as bad as it was. Okay. This sucks. <laughs> it could be worse. Okay. Okay, hold on. I'll be back. No, come back. Don't leave me. Okay, let's see here. Ah, someone started turkey. Uh, okay. Sharon took a ton of pics while I was walking the pups this morning. That must have been lovely. Uh, beautiful here in Texas, 64. Very nice. Uh, Dean is saying, yep, I'm towards Buffalo right now. I'm sure there's a lot more snow coming. Evan had good all the traditional foods. Doug had turkey to last until next year. What about at Christmas? You're going to get more. Dean's turkeyed out. Okay, give me give me a one, two, three, check, check. One, two, three, check, check. Christmas crap, Christmas crap. It's nice We're going to sell some Christmas crap. Okay, it's good. There's no more. Okay, okay. As long as my Smurf is happy. <laughs> It's all that matters. All right. Uh, I'm sorry, guys. All our technical, technical stuff. Let's see. All right. So I'm having, I'm having a problem with StreamYard. Look at my shirt. What happens at quilt camp stays at quilt camp. That Q kind of looks like a G, like guilt camp. A lot of people say that. It does. So StreamYard, I've been having an issue. Um, everything else on my phone is fine, but StreamYard, I can't, I can't hear unless I have headphones plugged in. And I didn't have a problem with our listing live last night because I went live from my laptop. Okay. Hey, you've got, I'd like to read something here. I can't put it on the screen. Elaine Lyman, can you see that comment? Listen, you you tell me. Okay. I can't put it on. There you go. 
Okay. Hi, Jan. I'm a new subscriber and have been going through all your videos from the beginning. I'm watching April, the month of April now. I wanted you to know that I'm one of your new cheerleaders. Woohoo! A new peep! And, and look at Elaine Lyman's uh, little avatar. Ship it. Cool. Nice. Elaine, you're a reseller, I take it. What state are you in or what province? And Valerie Gamish loves Christmas crap. We love Christmas crap. <sighs> Are you A J R N V V nine zero five nine zero five at gmail dot com. Mm. Elaine is a reseller from Connecticut. Hello, Elaine. Shift Conne it. Connecticut is not far. Okay. It's not like California. Think... No, it's not a different time zone. Blue Flamingo Mercantile's here. Hi, Lori. Hello. Jack and Piper's here from New Brunswick. We got a lot of Canadians in here. Okay, Julie Smurf, if you pop out. Hi. In... What? She can read my mind now. I didn't even have to finish my sentence. We're so in sync. Shit. I didn't even get to tell her what to do. Maybe she knows what to do. She's such a silly smurf. Yeah, that was totally quick, right? Oh, she's back. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> All right, try your godlike powers now. Okay. Did you did you click the email? Yes, I did. And I'm gonna click on that. There we go. Whoa, that was quick. Perfect. Yay, Canada. That's right, Sharon. Lori saying hi to everybody. Lori's down in Florida. How warm is it down there, Lori? Give us details. Yeah. Tell us about warmth. It makes us happy. Yeah, not me. Not a... Right now? No, no. D uh, just a little warm? No, I got my house oh. at 64. Well, I still have my air conditioner on in my bedroom. What? Yeah. Well, I mean, it's on fan, but... <laughs> oh, man. Babe says I'm an Eskimo. Oh, dear. So Lori, I just want to say Lori is saying it's chilly in the low 70s. Oh, yeah. Burr. <laughs> Whatever, man. Oh, that's awesome, Lori. It's pretty cold here. Okay. So I just cranked up the heat. So I always turn it down way low when I leave. So I'm just uh, I'm just pacing <laughs> so I can feel my fingers. Oh, it's that cold, girl? Um, well, I think, uh, so yesterday I came in here and the heat wasn't on at all. And, uh, I went over to the thermostat and the thermostat was dark. So it needed batteries. Simple okay. fix. What that means What's in that Celsius? Mean in Celsius? I don't know. We okay, have to Google that. By. I'll tell you what it is. Celsius. Hmm. I keep mine on Fahrenheit because I grew up with uh, Fahrenheit. Hi, Yvonne. Guess what I found? What'd you find? Oh, you already know. You can't Oh, guess. I know. Yes. But it took me a while to guess. Yeah. 70 Fahrenheit is 21 Celsius. We're at 30 degrees Fahrenheit here, which is minus one Celsius. I found another ceramic Christmas tree. Oh, look at that. Christmas crap. Christmas. Okay, what inch high is that? How tall is that sucker? Well, that is a good question, but it's got all its bulbs. Let me see where my ruler is. Christmas crap, Christmas crap. I'm going to sell some more Christmas crap. <laughs> Everyone's saying like, wow, about yeah. your Christmas. This is That's your like third what? Or... Our, I think it's the fourth one. Fourth one. See, I can only remember 
the the one the smaller one that you sold recently. I did that was one musical. in Misty's. You did? See, I can't I'm oh, Misty's man. was the musical one. Okay. And then we had a smaller one that had snow tipped branches and the little top was chipped. God, yeah, that sounds so long ago. Yeah. And then we had a little one that was in a peekaboo box. Okay. And look at that. Elf. This one. Oh, sorry. You got to show us that out. 16 inches. 16 inches tall. Whoa. Is it a hollow mold? I don't know. Let's and that see. Alpha, yeah. Why don't you tilt that over? I'm, I'm, I only so have two hands, Missy. Look at. I'm telling you. We need to see the little elf next. Oh, you've seen the elf already. You oh, goof. Maybe we see it together again. I can't. Let's remember. see. What do we got? I what don't see. I don't see it's that this is. Nicely painted. It's very nicely painted. And it doesn't it has seem a... to have any chipper roots. No, there's no chips. It's got holly leaves on the bottom. Yeah, you can it's... change the the layout if you want. Okay. It's got holly leaves on the bottom. It's in great shape. Yeah, it is. And then this guy. All right, hold on. I gotta. I need two hands for this, Julie. All right. Two hands. Uh. I see. Uh oh. Oh, 1985. Okay, let's see what we got there. O M M T. Yeah, I don't see. I don't see a mold mark on this. Nancy's saying pretty base. So many of the bases are plain. Yeah, I agree. Hello, Miss Nance. Yeah, so that surprised me. We were uh, we were down in the basement because Chris from Crispy Toys right came back yesterday, and right he bought some more toys. And while I was looking nice. for, because he took some hanging lamps to his booth for okay. me. And while I was looking, that's not a chip. That's just a thin paint there. Um, while he, while we were looking for that, I tripped over the box in the dark down in the basement. And it had this Christmas tree and it had this, yeah, this look thing. That. That's awesome. Look, look how at old that, that is. And it's all it. uh, chenille. Oh, I love it. So it's got chenille all around it, ribbons around it. It's and the got... cord is like a nice clothy color. Yeah. And it's got little uh, foil poinsettias down here. Wow. That's, that's really old, Julie. That is. But Rhonda's somebody, somebody made it. Rhonda's congratulating you on your sales with Crispy. Yes. I was very happy about that. And this guy was in the sale. Nobody, nobody loved him. Yeah. The poor a little gnome guy. with a squirrel. And the big boots. And the big boots. Evan's <laughs> saying she had one of those. Not that, not the big boot uh, gnome, but that. Oh, this thing? I think so. Huh. Well, and this guy is still for sale. He did not sell in the sale. I don't remember how much we charged for him, though. So, Nebby if anybody Powell wants him, make Nebby it Nebby Powell is here saying hello, Jan. Hello. And then we found a little, this box Ooh, that was in cute. that box with a little raised um, horse. Horse, and then all these guys were in Ooh, this box. We got. Ooh, look at them! Ooh, look these at are that Santa. pretty freaking cool. Yeah, very very nice. Nancy's reminding you to make sure to leave the cord and its end on the piece. People can get new old looking wires. But oh yeah, the end piece to restore it. Santa's. A little pen Santa. Ooh. Hello, Julie. Hello, pen Santa. 
<laughs> oh boy, here we go. <laughs> oh, Three Sheets Marie has popped in saying happy Sunday. Hi, Marie. These say they were originally, these two guys were from Pier 1. Oh, nice. And then these are signed. Magic of Santa, Roseanne, 1995. And they all oh, have like individual price tags. So I'm feeling she got them at a craft show. <coughs> Pardon me. I'm going to, I'm going to, we got a new, new person in the house. Uh, Terry, it says, she says, hi, I'm Sue, Terry's wife from the UK. Jan, you have a lot of stuff to shift. It may take a while. It's a lot of work for you, but I'm finding it all very interesting and learning a lot. Oh, I'm so happy to hear that. Thanks for coming, Sue. Yeah, so these, really guys, cool. these guys are going to gonna be in Wednesday's sale. And Wednesday's sale is uh, Noelle is going to come sell with me. Yes, that's right. She's going to yep. have some good stuff. So those are new finds that you guys haven't seen. Very cool. What else you got up your Christmas crap sleeve? Oh, gosh, so much. I mean, this is still all vintage ornaments and stuff. Not up there. Those are newer. But I got all these old bulbs. Love it. So I'm still working through my Christmas crap. Christmas crap. She's still so a much. Christmas crap. crap. And I have, to do an, I have to do a Christmas ephemera lot this time. Okay, good. Maybe we could start building it. Yeah. Yeah, that's a good idea. Nebby that's a good idea. Your stuff is old. You could start your own muse museum. I could, but I won't because I don't want to because I want to sell it all. And here's more uh, eBay stuff working in here. <laughs> Jan. What? Don, Don Wright from Canada is saying, laughing my ass off. I thought you said, what else you got up your Christmas? Christ? Nice. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's probably come into play. I am wandering because, oh, there it is. Oh, my God, that's hilarious. Looking for my Borg bra. Hey, would you be able to sell that candle glow mold that we can all just see the tip of there in a live sale? I, I could try, I guess. Or even just a, the top to one there in the box. Oh, no, it's got a no, stand to go these, with it. No, are, these are complete. <laughs> These he are could ship those easy. These, of course, he could ship them. I just got to clean them. Sorry, and I only Donna. have this little sink, you know. I had to put Don's thing back up there because I'm sorry. I thought it's, it's quite funny. I think it's hilarious. Oh my God. That's really funny. All right. <laughs> Hang on. Let me, let me, let me get the Borg bra on here. Yes. Get, get Borg down. <coughs> well, the one thing we, I know for sure we got to do is we got to shut the, shut the door upstairs. Okay, because it's getting too chilly, Billy. Because it's getting too chilly, yep. Hold on, I'm putting you down. Okay. Even the smaller candles have been selling well. Okay, that's good. Excellent. How tall do you think those glow, glow molds are? Like 32 inches tall? 30 inches tall? How would you ship them? You'd have to Frankenstein a box. Where'd we? Oh, we've got uh -oh. Sarah Yates is here saying hello all, trying to continue listing, sorting, etc. Also want to make my pecan pie and cookies, hopefully. Yum. Pecan pie. Let's see, Don, I use chit chats. That's what I use. Because I don't know what stallion does actually chit chats is easy for me because it's basically five minutes from my house and i even use it for shipping inside mm -hmm. canada it's cheaper than canada post with my discount on as okay. a small business talking canadian stuff aren't you yeah sarah yates is making pecan pie and cookies holy cow you just got me super loud did i you did. I fixed it, though. Let's, Nancy saying, Lori, I do not have you blocked. If you cannot see me, you may have blocked me, which means she can't see this. Well, so. she can certainly see it on the screen. Yeah. 
I've put on the screen. Yeah. All right. Let me, uh, what a, what a waste of an hour and a half. Uh, yeah. the stream yard couldn't fix it. So I'm going to pull more Christmas stuff out, but that's like, um, yeah, I, I want to do a craft lot. <coughs> so let's do that. Cause that will help me shut the door. Yeah. Yeah, Rhonda, Chit Chats is right down by Mr. Burger on uh, your street. Mm, Mr. Burger, steak burgers, on the mm, steak double on cheeseburger the with bacon, meat cookies, meat mm. cookies. Mm. <laughs> oh, Julie, we got stuff wrong with us, Julie. Meat cookies, yum. Does anybody know what meat cookies are? Other than me? Yeah, I schooled Jan on meat cookies. Anyone else know what a meat cookie is? <coughs> <laughs> uh, meat cookies are the itty bitty burger patties at McDonald's. Mm, meat cookies. Julie likes double meat cookies. Oh, yes. Oh, Don, are you like here in Durham? Never tried Mr. Burger, but drove by the lot. Oh, when you lived there. Oh yeah, you're down London way. I miss Licks and Whippy. Yeah, their burgers are just too garlicky. I don't like. Okay, meat cookies. Can I use that with my scouts? You could, it's just another term that we use for McDonald's cheeseburgers or hamburgers or the uh, McDoubles. We call them meat cookies. Mm. <laughs> what is that? Uh, How do we have two people in here now? Oh, who is it? It's your it's me. Oh, my! You know, it doesn't matter how old our kids get; they still call one after the other if you don't answer. Sorry, I was reading and trying to listen to you. I apologize. That's okay. I'm not good at it. I just am not good at it. I could never be a 911 operator. I would, people would die on my watch. Oh my, oh my gosh. <laughs> That's where I am. I'm in, well, we call it the, the schwa, Don, the schwa. But I like, oh my gosh. Derek, Derek, is that your son? That is my son that was just war dialing me that keeps kicking me off. <laughs> <laughs> What's a, oh, a yo. I don't know. My... It's kid slang. Oh, okay. Derek, please translate. Yeah. What's it mean? A and how old is he? Is oh, he no. Like... It's, it's Italian. It's our a yo. Oh. Hey, yo. My bad, yo. dog. <laughs> hey, yo. <laughs> All right, so I am, Julie, don't let me forget, I'm on the upstairs uh, repeater now. Okay, I think I should write that down because, you know. Okay, just in case. Yeah. So I'm going to say up on, you're up on the upstairs repeater? Yeah. Upstairs repeater. That's my bug. That's my bug. And I need to tell you this before we shut down or oh, why, why do we need to know that? Just out of curiosity. Because when I go downstairs, I need to switch back. Remember, okay. this is the room that we didn't get a signal before and I added right. a repeater. Yes. I remember now. It's all yes. coming back to me. Okay. So that's what we're doing. So we're after Christmas crap. <gasps> Christmas crap. Yes. Look at Ooh, all the Christmas look. crap. Oh, let's get it. Oh, okay. come on. I'm on it. Come on, girl. I'm on it. I just got, you got your good shoes on. Uh, yeah, I get a, a couple things in the way here. Ooh, that really needs new cheese. We should list that. Yeah, actually, we should look at uh, Jack and Piper saying, "Hi, Derek. Your mom's a superwoman. Totally." <laughs> See, Derek, they think I'm cool. Yeah, we do. He thinks I'm cool. She's so funny. Oh, he gets he gets his sense home. of humor from me. 
All right. I know. Hi, empty nesting, Maria. In here. Let me in. Oh, yeah. Oh, looky, looky. Christmas oh, that's craft. Good. That's good Christmas crafting that's good Christmas. Crap. Yeah, we want, we want that's some nice craft lots. Some, yeah, that's going to do real and good. These, these are empty. Did you see that, Three Sheets Marie? Did you see Bins. that box of nice Christmas stuff? crap? Oh, Brett's here. Hello, Miss Brett. What did I miss? Oh, my gosh. What did I miss? You missed 30 minutes of camera issues, sound issues, and me yeah. driving. Pretty much. So you came just in time. Perfect timing. Perfect timing, Brett. Let's see what's in this one. We want to see some cool Christmas. Let's see. We got buttons. We got... Oh, uh, those things. We got a holy crap glue gun. Mm, that's heavy duty. That's mm -hmm. industrial. It's industrial. Industrial glue gun. Let's see what else we got in here. We oh, got the that's how to make those. That's eggs. the goose egg that my mom made. Very nice. What are these? This is an old. Uh, Huh. Glass machinery. Okay, well those don't those can't go in here. So we got more buttons. Oh no, that's the same package of buttons, Jan. Evan no one's going, ooh, instructions. Yes, I agree. Let's see. What's in here? Old wooden spools. Those are good for craft lots. Those are really Christmas good crap. Craft lots. Yeah, Christmas There's a, crap. a bear in a bikini in a bag. Interesting. Mm hmm. There is. Hold oh. your camera down a bit so we can see. There you. Everybody always tells me to hold it up. Okay. So this is a bear baby. But she's somebody made clothes for her. Oh, she's got poopy diaper. <laughs> <laughs> I really got to work on that filter. Let's oh, see. Uh, I don't. She's she's uh, porcelain. That's very. Just so know. you know, we're staring at a wall. There we go. Oh, for the love! I'm telling I'm you, putting you it down. Subscribers have come here not to look at the wall. Yeah. That's better. Ooh, interesting. Well, I mean, these are these are just craft stuff, but I mean, they're more for like to make jars pretty. Okay. Right. But you've got you've set aside those wooden spools, right? The wooden for spools are right here. Okay. Good. Good. Um, thermo grip glue gun. Uh, something tells me that that's not going to be a highly desirable item. Oh, I know what these are. Balloons? No. You know what these are, Julie? For the cleaners? when you used to do no, you used to make um pot holders. On oh. the there's a metal. Let's see, where have I seen it? I've seen it somewhere. Somewhere in here, perhaps. Yes! Whoa! Talk Jan! To Talk to us. Can't remember why you walked into a room, but you can remember where all this crap is hidden. Really? Oh, there you go. Remember these? Yes. Vaguely. Vaguely. Kim Murphy saying a loom. Yes. Lucky boy, lucky boy is saying metal loom. Yes. These are the little ties for them. And we used to make um my OCD's kicking in. I got to I got to put these back on the sides. We used to make uh pot holders for everybody. Yes. 
Missy Cat is saying, made those pot holders in the 50s. Yep. And well, Jack I wasn't in the pipe. 50s, but no. I think it was a toy at my grandmother's house that my mom played with. And then uh, we got to play with it later. Cool. Evan Owen's making a pot holder rug. Sharon Delaney said she used to make those back in the 60s. Yeah. And Brett is saying, oh, I never saw them made by my mom, but have, have some in her drawers. Yep. Cool. That this I is how they were made. And this is a things. big bag of supplies for them. Like things together. But maybe. Winning. That, hey, but maybe that could be a craft lot to, for Wednesday. For Christmas crafts? But people could maybe use like red and green and a little splash of white. I don't know. <clears throat> well, I don't have red and green and a splash of white. I have a billion different colors. <laughs> Nancy's saying slap a price on that bag and email me. All righty. Can you mark that down for me, yes. Miss Julie? Because I'll forget. You got it. All right. Uh, in this Christmas crap lot, we're going to put some wooden spools, some, uh, yeah, that doesn't need to pack a box in a box. That's not necessary, Jan. What else we got in here? Oh, look, there's some Christmas crap. Mr. Humstone has uh, popped in saying, ladies. Hello, tip, Mr. Harry. Little tip of his hat. This is more of those super old bulbs that you had, Julie. Oh, nice. On the picks? Oh, no, light bulbs. Yes, with the, yeah, the little ribs the, in them. Yes, yeah. very nice. And an old uh, wire for something. Auntie, Auntie Christie's popped in saying, hello. Hello, Auntie Christie. We're making a Christmas crap lot. Okay, uh, Evan and Auntie Christy are saying they love that snowflake. So I love that snowflake. We will keep that snowflake and take it downstairs. What else we got here? Yeah, what's in there? Show us. Oh, Ooh. that is non-Christmas ribbon. Okay. But I can go down because, you know, there's so much space downstairs. People are just talking about the pot holder loops and things. Oh, those are cool. Oh, fruit. Fruit. Poinsettias. Nuts. Yeah. Poins Look at that. The white poinsettias. Very nice. Those could definitely yes, for go sure. in a Christmas crap lot. Uh oh, oh I Lulu dropped a Fisher, grape. Um, is, has a question. Jan, did you find the menorah? Crap! I forgot about it. It's on the it's on the thing at home. Okay. Babes, are you still in Pavilion or are you home? And Nessa Fines saying hello. Love your videos, Jan. Oh, thank you. I never thought that so many people would be watching them and enjoying them. I had somebody tell me the other day that they said that it was uh, better than a reality show. And all I could think about was the, you ever see that Jim Carrey movie where he's like a character in a show? Truman. Truman. Where he's like standing in the bathroom making voices to himself and like checking yep. his teeth. Yeah. I'm like, that that's that's basically what I'm doing here. <laughs> okay, those are good. Fruit is not Christmas. Oh, hold on. Would we knock over here? Three sheets for re saying the fruit and everything was just nice in a cornucopia. Yep. Oh, there's those. Those Ooh, uh, frosted sugar plums. Pottery barn. All right. Well, that goes there. Oh, I can't wait till I can walk in all these rooms. 
but I am starting to put together uh, more difficult stuff to ship. I try to do a hard thing. What's in here? Ooh, garbage. Yay! Oh. See. Evan's saying the sugared grapes are good for displays. What's in this one? Uh, uh, no, no falling. Easy, easy. Ooh. Those are lamps. That's not helpful. It's for Christmas. Oh, Christmas crap lot. We need Christmas <coughs> crap, Christmas crap. Um, What's on the floor there kind of to your left, the, on the floor though, that streak down red stuff there, the box. It this? Looks like, no, well, I can't, that, yeah, all that stuff. Um, going to make see me go there. through that. Like I see stuff. it. Let's go Let's through just, it. Look, thank goodness. <sighs> we want some vintage Christmas crap. I know. I still can't oh. believe I'm still finding it. Hey, and are those like metal baskets there? Galvanite? Oh no, they're just that like, thing. Yeah, that thing yeah. stretches out. It's okay. a rack. Cool. Okay. Put that clock down there. Kim Kim Murphy saying um, she just sold a wicker cornucopia. I love saying that word. On Very Kim nice. With five sets of vintage grapes in it. Very cool, Kim. Those are more lampshades. Because this is the lampshade room. All right. Got my little dragonfly table that I can sit on. Nice. Let's see. This is the, the light that I abandoned. Ooh. Auntie all Christy right. is saying, Jan, and and through all of this, you have a whole new community and friendships you otherwise might not have met or made. So true. So true. Let's see. We have... Terry, Terry saying, I love watching and listening to you both. So relaxing. Much better than a reality so show. Nice. Ooh, nice got little. some tidbits there plates they don't sound this is like, not your room sounds like restaurant wear this is not your room sounds vetrified let's see golf balls right uh got some old drugs got uh a walnut um putty lid uh ceramic um Light Recycle. socket. All right. Oh. Let's see. Old clothespins, old keychains. There's part of an old lamp. So no Christmassy stuff. I'm looking. Let's see. We have a beheaded angel. Ooh, I like that. That would be, Evan would totally, Amy would totally make something out of that. Actually, uh, Amy's saying it's weird we haven't seen a lot of fairy lamps. I, I think that those are still in her booth boxes. Ah, uh, which are in the trailer, Doug thing. Yeah. We will, uh, we will open those up once the barn is done so that I can open the box, look at it, and move it. What is that? Brett's happy to hear the, this is not your room. We, she says we haven't yes. heard that for a while. <laughs> Ooh, look at that little. Well, that's interesting. Is that one of those little. Uh, Made organs? in England. It's a folding oh, wine sure. cork with yeah. a little case. Wasn't well, that a neat little stuffer. thing? <laughs> yeah, that'll. That doesn't really fall under very many categories. That should go downstairs on the little things I don't know what to do with shelf. I think we're going to make little peekaboo boxes of all those little things. Yes. You don't, like, you know, like you see them on uh, eBay, actually. Peekaboo boxes? Drawers. Well, no, they say contents of drawer or junk drawers. Oh, yeah, junk drawers. Yes, yes. All right, let me turn a little. 
Everyone Ooh. kind of liked that. Kim Murphy saying she loved that. Brett the peekaboo saying, box? Yeah. Well, no, the little um, English, oh, the little thing. tiny. They, like, that, Brett liked the graphics. Terry was going, yay, England. I'm not sure what this stuff goes to, but this is hardware. Sue. Terry Sue. This is probably a... Oh, look at that little guy. What is it? <laughs> I can't see it. Oh. He's in a little, like, shuttlecraft. Er, er, T something. He's a toy. He's a toy. Um, Annie Christie saying, better because we can engage, <laughs> ask questions. Oh, dear. Angry troll. Angry troll. Listen, Annie Christie's telling you because we can engage and ask questions, learn, but things about things and buy things, excuse me, and be part of the progress. And the best part is that there isn't any unnecessary drama like a reality show. Oh, I can oh, give you drama. It. No. Oops. Um, no drama. For anybody that didn't hear, babes fell off the roof. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Wow, there's all kinds of stuff in here. Brett saying uh, that little piece might be a good eBay item by itself. Look at those little oh, shoes. This is booty. such a strange drawer. See, and that's a good thing for eBay. Yeah, but how do how does you just how does like, all this junk stuff drawer. junk drawer? But but how did it happen? Um, that's a good question. It's a really good question. That's what I try to figure out when I because I used to. I mean, I've gone through probably a hundred boxes and drawers like this. And I'm just like, how how did it come to be? How did its existence happen? Yes. What is the biological nature? Yeah. What what, what was <laughs> or what the was, physics? What, what was mom's mentality? Uh, when a lot this of box people are created? loving that bottle opener. The bottle and opener. I should list it, huh? Brett. Uh, and this Christy feels saying, like a in ceiling London, they sell job lots, like a junk drawer lot. Yes. Let's see. Okay. And Brett is being thankful that oh, babe said he did not ha have a nail in his hand when he fell. Oh, <laughs> true story. He missed the pile of bricks too. Thank God. Uh, yes, Maggie. He is okay, but yep. he did twist his ankle a bit. But it's okay. Yes. Babes is Rhonda. okay. Rhonda Lockery is saying maybe about the drawer. That's cool. Um, it's like a... That your mom may have been cleaning up and put it all in a box. Yeah, but like a hundred of these happened. Yeah, that's true. It's papers. Yeah, okay, right. saying it happened the same way any other junk drawer happens. Something small in your hand and go, eh, let's just throw it in this drawer. <laughs> Kim Murphy would like you to sell the bottle opener right now on the show. Okay. We'll do an offer up. Okay. Hold on. Someone start with a number for the little, Jane's going to get it. The little yep, I got to get it. Pork Just trying to made in England with the cool graphic with a little snap on it. Snap. Yep. Scroll. All right. This and this. Those need to go downstairs. Those are magazines. This is not your room. <laughs> <laughs> this is, however, going to stay your room for now. Right there is good. Garbage bag. Oops. Okay, I've bumped into that nine times now, so it's losing Time its spot. Go. Ooh, love it. Alice Barber Copyright CS Pack Society. Very cool. Huh, well... It is very cool, but it doesn't belong where my elbow goes when I go through that room. 
Yvonne's saying you need to get a shirt that says, this is not your room. Yes. Are there any nails on this wall? That's why it ended up there. Because <laughs> there's no place to put it. Whose room is it? All right, it's got to go downstairs in the art room. Doesn't, it can't be here. Okay. All right. What are we looking at here? We're looking at this little guy. Yes. It's got a little, oh, it's even got like a beer, a pint of beer. Yeah. A bottle and a martini glass. Very nice. Got Let's a little see. snap. Very little, nice. Oh, oh, down there. Oh. What's it say? Real leather. Yes. Made in England. That's what it says. You open it up. The snap has a name on it, which I cannot read. We're at $6. Doug, you're awesome. Doug just started offer up folding bottle opener, starting price $5. Let's unload this house. He's awesome. Doug is awesome. Made in Here we England. got made in England. We're at $7. And it opens up like this, and it's got a bottle opener on this end, and it's got a nice sharp corkscrew in the middle for twisting. Very cool, Leo. That's a yeah, bottle opener and then like a can opener. We're at eight dollars. Kim Murphy, eight dollars. Made in England. Auntie Christy, nine dollars. That is so stinking cute. <laughs> yeah, that's what I was wondering, Amy. Ask, asking price is close to 30, huh? Kim Murphy want, is at 10. I want to know N E. What does that say? Christy, Andy Christie's out. Real leather, made in England. It's in really good shape. Mm -hmm. I feel like it says Newey, N E W E Y. Very nice. Do you want to count it down, Jan? Annie Christie's yep. out. We're sitting counting it here. down. Here we go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and sold. Waiting for Doug to do his thighing. Here comes Nancy Cal out of the woodwork. Yep. And it's Nancy Cal at 12. Thank you, Nancy. Awesome. That's lovely. I like that. What a cool little thing. Great stocking stuffer. Mm-hmm. We're going to put that right there. Julie. And, yeah. Oh, it's dear. right there. Oh, man. To get it downstairs. <laughs> <laughs> Can't you put it in your pocket? Oh, good idea. That's a better okay. spot. <laughs> Just in case I have to open Nancy. a bottle of wine today. Uh, Nancy, um, I'm, have you emailed? Yes. You? Okay. I'm pretty sure on. I have. I okay, have. Okay, good. If I don't, just email me. That was fun. Yeah. Anytime you guys, will, if you see something, you can give me a reasonable price. Let's go. Awesome, Jan. What's this? Sirocco. <gasps> Sirocco, Sirocco wood. That, what? Oh. It's like a... <laughs> it's very Art Nouveau-ish. Yeah, and Sirocco's kind of cool. It should have some Roman numerals on the back, and we can actually date it. Yeah, there's only a sticker there. I I'm just trying to... I'll put it right there. Along the hallway. Nancy Kel saying you should have her um, mailing. Yep. Info. 
All right, this is Christmas crab that goes down. These are empty bins. We'll use those to fill and carry. And Kevin Owen saying e eBay the uh, Christmas crap, or not the Christmas crap, the uh, Sirocco. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I don't. I mean, Babes could find a box. He could make a box for it. All right, I need more room. So let's take this stuff down and this down. It's actually a mid-century modern shelving piece, Nancy's saying. Um, oh, yeah? She's saying Sirocco made some cool jungle-inspired stuff. Yeah, when I say stuff like Art Nouveau, don't assume I know what I'm talking about. Doug's got a question. Blue. He's asking you... How many boxes of those sugared grapes do you have? Um, I think just that box. Okay. There you That's go. That's the only one I've seen. PC's noticed how much more space there is in that room. So much more space. Yeah, it's incredible. We have look at all this beautiful floor. It's incredible. And this pile is very loosely piled with empty boxes all right so we got some christmas crap Babes. i found some Brett seems to think there's three boxes of the grapes the sugared grapes okay i'll go look near there christmas crap christmas crap we're gonna sell some christmas crap and Amy's um, saying, just to remind you, sugared fruit and, and ornaments sell decently. Oh, good. And Yvonne's telling everyone to thumbs up. Let's go. All right. Yeah, definitely more grapes. Brett um, had her eye on it. PC's confirming. Nancy Cal, $12. Yep. Put her, put that on the way out the door. And you know what you got to do is you got to mm. grab those, that bag of pot holders. Because the other Nancy wants to buy Oh, those. she wants those. Okay. Yeah. According to my notes. Fantastic. I love it when the Smurf takes notes. <laughs> Thumbs up, Yvonne saying. I want to bring that junk drawer box down here. Yeah. I don't actually, I think it would be fun just to list it on eBay. List it just like that? Fun. Oh, I, just for fun. Why not? Why no. not? What do we got to lose? Let's have some fun. You know, man. the diamond ruby ring in the bottom of the of the thing. Okay. Well, we'll go through it first. The okay. Look at diamonds, rubies, sapphires, emeralds, all those precious stones, all them good flavors. Okay. We'll check. Okay. It'll be fun just to go through. What a weird drawer. Great drawer. All right. I love that kind of stuff. What do we got here? We got. One footy cookie monster. We got toys. So let me get a glass of small. Water. PC's reminding you to grab some water. You've been out of an hour. Okay. Ooh, that's cool. Tupperware, isn't it? Yeah, Shall it's we? about to get toys in it. Oh. I don't know what that is. Yeah. It's, um, Annie Christie saying the angry Smurf troll is epic. This yeah. guy? Oh, yeah. Got to go in the He's something. Door. He's even got a pendant so you can wear him. Oh, awesome. Look at his little cheeks. Oh. Does he have any Christmas crack? Does that have Christmas crack? Chris He's got a Christmas crack. <laughs> <laughs> Here she goes. She's going to pee. Oh, oh dear. Right, we got hardware oh. over here. <clears throat> oh, right. <clears throat> Very good reminder. Thank you. Switch Wi-Fi. Jam Volkswagen. Oh, I'm on Please it. Don't forget, don't forget to do it right now. Nice. Nice jam. Thank you.
Awesome. <laughs> Don, we were looking at a little tiny, uh, about this big blue angry troll. And Jan says, look at his cheeks. And we called it his Christmas crack. <laughs> Don says, that what is what I we do Christmas on this channel. <laughs> Because we make stuff up to amuse ourselves. Oh, boy. I guess that's a toy. These are craft crap. That Chris, is just... Uh, Ross, Rosselli saying, I remember doing this clean out at my mom's house. Oh. God bless you. What's that? Oh, what it's a also? baby with a blanket. Oh, is it a kittle? Actually, that looks like metal. It's like got a metal face to it, I think. What? Yeah. How, we'll how, the... how can you even do that? Well, I had kittles. I don't know. I could be totally wrong. Oh, Pat Doodles popped, is popped in. Hello, Miss Pat. There is a sock. I think it's safe to let the sock go. You never know. Leave it in. Oh, you're killing me, Smalls. I'm telling you. Let's do an experiment. Let's have some fun. Oh, vintage Christmas wrapping paper. Mm -hmm. What? Ooh, two sheets. Not a kittle. Okay. Thought it was close, Evan or Amy. Look at the vintage wrapping. Very small pieces. You know what? Look at that Santa face. That Santa face is cool. I have a wrapping paper lot going. So I will just put these for Wednesday in there. Yep. Where's my. Just so you know, your subscribers are helping out um, another subscriber how to improve a specific listing of shirts. Nice. Fruit. Yeah. Do it, guys. Do it. Yeah, it's, re it's really, it's really Throw nice. Throw down the knowledge. Yep. Um, yeah, double-sided paper. That's right, Amy. That was very cool paper. Let's see. Yvonne's saying, I need that paper. Ooh, those little pearls. Yeah, but the, it's, I mean, it's filthy. Okay, well, you, you dust it off. Or you can put it in a, a craft lot. Okay. Craft lot. Piece of driftwood. Oh, no, definitely do not chuck it. That's I know. staying in the junk drawer. This is awesome. This is a true junk drawer. Ooh, what is it? Seeds. Okay. Oh, there you go. Some bean seeds. I don't think you can you sell those on eBay? Yeah. If okay. Noel could sell quince. Oh, that's true. Yeah. This is one of the old member of these with yes, to do your ponytail. Bobbles. Yes. Yes. Nice. Yeah, the stretch is gone. Um, the brooch of some sort? No, it was part of a plastic toy. Magic Beans PC said those were. This yeah, is a Japanese. plastic spool. Little Japan, but I think it can go. Okay. It's going. It's filthy. It's yucky. Rhonda Lockery's having a flashback to that hair bobble. Andy Christie is saying those hurt so bad when you missed. And Farm Girl Scavenger saying, okay, saying, hey, but starting to dry, so can't talk. Love you all. Oh. I, I love Grandma. I yeah. Love grandma. But they're filthy. Oh, good point. Amy's saying people like seed packets for crafts and display. What is that? Well, it's a, it's a pterodactyl claw. I believe so. With, um, I don't know. Oh, look Doug, at Doug, watch out! Doug, close your eyes! Doug, no! What is that? Oh, Doug, close. Oh, look at those eyes. Look at those eyes. <laughs> Don't look, Doug. No, no. That is so random. 
Oh, Doug. No. Look at the lips. Yeah, it's pretty cool. All right. Um, <laughs> I want to go. A bottle cap. I think that can be thrown out. A piece of broken glass. That can go. Now, that is actually um, a cake. Yes. Tip. That's, Squeezer. that's the, the old tip yeah. for. I've got that I somewhere. I have been finding those all over. Pat Doodles is saying she's been in a she shed studio working all day. I set a lot of boxes outside under the A wing now to sort and see what I keep and what to sell. I feel a huge sale coming on. Nice. Saying. Pat, you want to do a sale next Wednesday with me? This coming Wednesday, um, Noelle is, nice. is coming. Look at him. Ooh. Toy. Yeah, I don't I know. Think he needs to be cleaned. This is a dead plant. That's seeds. This is seeds. Buzz Lightyear. Mm. Buzz Lightyear. I mean, really? What a. I think he can go. Mm, that's cool. Oh my. Aren't you? What do you what, what do you it? got on you? What does she do? Why has she got this thing on her? I'm so confused by this toy. She's got some sort of crown. Someone will know what it is. I don't know. I think she's... Uh, oh, she Pat Doodles said that would be fine. I would love to do a sale with you. I, oh, I nice. Do, Let's do it. You. She's going to email you, and you guys can set it up. Okay. So, oddly enough, I know exactly what this is. Can you so believe that? Ice scraper? Nope, it's the side to a Connect Four game. Whoa. Can't even believe I know that. That's crazy. Yeah, I'm crazy. <laughs> little little Tykes uh, chairs. Good. No wonder I avoided this box. Superman Burger King toy. Um... Dog. Like a, a tip to a baton there, that white yeah. rubber thing, yeah. I'm, little that, tykes. That Brett, can all go. Um, yeah. Brett's telling you the little tykes are a big dollar, like do $2 sign, so I think that's nice. pretty big. Yeah. Ooh, that's creepy. Mm-hmm. It's a, is it a finger puppet? I don't know what it is. It looks like it's all little toys. Money? Money? Nope. Oh. No. Paper. One day, Paper. maybe. Mad Zambinga is saying it's like the bin of misfit toys. It oh, is. Poor little misfit toys on that island. That always made me feel so sad as a child watching that. It's a little doll dress, maybe, or something. Pants? I don't know. It's got a snap on it. I, I don't... I don't know what that... Oh, it's a foot! It's a, it's a booty! <laughs> it's a booty. Uh, it's a yucky... Booty, and here's a yucky matching booty. I really, those can go. Yeah, that was dirty. Yeah, yeah. Tigger hardware, baby food jar top. Yvonne saying, um, Kim Murphy would like to do a live sale with you. Okay, send me an email. 
send me an email. We'll play around in StreamYard. Ooh, that car's got moving parts. Murphy Kim Murphy. M my my stow. Kim, Ash do you know Jan's email address? It's on the screen when you um don't have a comment up. Okay, hang on. There you go. Oh well, no, it's just says... antiques from Karen at gmail dot com. A lot of these toys, I think I can just toss because I have seen a lot of them and I'm pretty sure that they are, um, I don't know, that that flower is toast. Toast. You know, Rhonda Lockyer saying, do a peekaboo toy box. Oh, I could That's do that. Interesting idea. My Bible Story Library, Battle of Jericho. Now, there isn't like a speck on this, in this drawer. That is so strange. Huh. <gasps> the match. Oh. Look at that. Oh, don't think cute. don't think they're worth saving but all right this is a this is one of those poly poly, poly whatever maybe i don't know i don't know it probably is i don't know enough about that stuff doug saying yes toss the toys into the junk drawer lot for ebay okay Ooh, superman yeah and his Bottom is here. What is oh, oh, oh that's nice. a cool toy. Yeah, I like that. Cats would love that for your cats. Oh, Oreo, you're in so much trouble. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, that is cool. Oh, yeah. I like it. Is that that's a keeper. Is that on McDonald's? What is that? Probably. Oh. Burger King. Cool. Evan suggesting to maybe wash you think them and eBay the little socks. See? Well, I have a bin of uh small doll clothes things. Ooh. Ooh that, I bet you that glows. Bet you it glows in the dark. Yeah, that's what I mean. Glows in the dark. Maybe we, we have to put it under sunlight. Okay, I'll put it in the window. Okay, good. <laughs> Alta Olden has a, a suggestion. She says you could call this lot. She says you could call it the the bottom of the toy box lot. True that. I like that. Brett saying, listen, I rarely buy but I bought a mystery jar from Misty's Live that her dad put together, and it was so much fun. I loved it. Do a little mix. I agree with Doug. Nice. That is heavy. 19, or does it, is there, is that a date? Right 96? Now? I don't know what that is, but that's not one of the cheap toys in here. We'll have to figure out what... Oh, no. Totally different. Brett, what kind of things are in the mystery jar? Tell us. Tell us. <laughs> happy Days is saying hello. Hi, Happy Days. Brett saying, oh, I paid for that jar. Okay, on uh, Misty's channel. But uh, what was in it? Oh, that's cool. Look at that little puppy. So many cute things were in it, she says. No details yet, just cute. Come on, Brett, spill it. 
Ooh, what's in here? Oh, cool. Negatives. Mm-hmm. Matt uh, Zambinga saying that little brown thing looks like a Star Wars vehicle. Interesting. Might want to check that out. Wow. Okay, what is it? So these are um, pictures to uh, one of my childhood friend's wedding. And my mother um, promptly lost the pictures somewhere in the house after she was the photographer for the wedding. Aww. And I found all these pictures um, recently. So I went hunting on the internet to see if I could find her. And uh, yeah, that's toast. And uh, I did end up finding her and left her a message and told her that I found her wedding pictures. And she said, that's fantastic. I'm married to somebody else, but I'd still love that. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Ooh, what's Those, that? Oh, they're Chippendale draw, nice. drawer pulls. Very nice. Yvonne's saying she saw the flying Superman thing. She saw it listed for 15 bucks. Seriously? That's for just she's... that toy? Oh, the three little pigs. Three little pigs golden book. Now let's Aww. do let's do our what Noel taught us. Yes, the uh, alpha thing. There's nothing nothing in the binding there, nothing in the binding there. So that is damaged and safe to go. Um, Another Sandy little sock. McNair is confirming it's part that little brown thing is part. That's what I was type. thinking. Yeah. So it, that, who knows? That could be like a cool piece that it could be a holy grail item. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I doubt it, but it's just fun to fantasize. Ooh, that looked good. Nancy suggesting to send the drawer pulls to rehouse. Oh, look at that Scooby. -Doo. This I have so much hardware, it's not even funny. And rehouse has so much hard. Oh, there's the broken girl again. Interesting. Oh, no, same one. Jawa. They're saying it's the Jawa vehicle from Star Wars. This that looks like looks... part of Optimus Prime. Oh. Who is upstairs. Got that. Uh, Amy Evan Owen saying, why not ask Crispy about it? Yeah. Could do that. He betcha he knows. Happy Looks Days like, is saying, could be worth something to Star Wars collectors. It's from the first movie, I think. Ooh. Oh, wow. It's a little tiny baby dress. Oh, cute. Another little footy. Little Daffy oh, Duck. Well, that's Donald, buddy. That was Donald. Pluto and one of his kids. Another dwarf. Now see that is that looks an awful like a lot like the Polly Pocket things. And I know cool. those go for pretty good money. Yes, they do. A pair of doll shoes. Ew, very, very dirty baby piggy. Ew, yuck. She needs her diaper change too. Pat Doodles is saying. If you have lots damaged little golden books, people will buy them for junk journals and craft projects. Nice. Well, I only have one, so I don't think anybody's going to... Here's the talons to whatever that foot was, too. Oh, incoming. Brett's telling us what she got in her drawer, or Ooh. her um, jar. Okay, she got a tiny metal advertising whistle. Lots of old keychain license plates, some charms, a two inch pair of pliers, two miniature gun lighters, one baby mini pinup lighter, another baby mini pinup lighter, magnets. Coaster. 
And that's, that's the type of stuff that goes in that junk drawer a lot. Ooh, look at that. Ooh. 1959 Chevy Impala. Impala. And it's from Pewter. The... USA. Can't read that second date. I think it said 82 to hold it to the, your camera again, my girl. Pull, pull back a little bit. Hold steady, steady. Yeah, I'm thinking 82. I don't know. Goody Ma is asking, any Barbie piano parts in that box? No, I haven't seen any of those, Miss Barb. But I always look. I mean, if I can actually figure out that that blue thing is part of a Connect Four, I'm going to recognize there immediately. Go. Nice. We got. I think it's 1992. Yeah. Um, yeah. Well, I was reading Brett's um, uh, treasure hall. Nancy, you held a little advertising thing. Yep. So like that goes. I have enamel pins. I have a place for those. Okay. Because she's asking if it was an advertising pin. Yeah. It's for Xerox. Oh, cool. Very nice. Team Izzy Aquatics, Atlanta, 1996. Somebody Ooh. lost their arm. Godzilla. I, think. I feel like we already saw this guy. Looks like Godzilla's arm. Nope, he's different. Hmm. Oh, a little Cabbage Patch Girl. Goody Ma saying hello, by the way. Hi, Barb. She says she just rolled in. Ooh, what's that? Was that a Hot Wheel? Car. That's a wooden Wait. game she... piece. Oh, okay. Um, that looks like part of a Transformer, too. Here's his head. Nancy's asking if the little Impala was made by Lesney. She says the Lesney pewter one sold recently for 26 US. Lesney. No, this is Rockcliffe. We have a whole bunch of Leslie uh, stuff too. Ooh, more stuff from the, the junk jar. Okay, uh, Brett's got a retract, re retractable keychain pencil. Maybe from Cracker Jack harmonica. Pocket knives. Like less than one inch. Cool. A Route 66 ring. Some advertising pencil clips. Best Western key. I love it. Here's the other arm. Oh, cool. That, I don't know what that is. That's a doll shoe. Here's another person's arm and here's okay these look like they go together interesting maybe i spent a lot of time on boxes like these in the beginning I bet. Auntie Christie's wondering, is the container that it's in, is it a, a refrigerator drawer? Yep. Crisper? Yep. That was like a little apron. Yep. It's a doll dress. The, I mean, the, at the very least, they'll go in the washing machine, and if they come clean, then they'll go in a doll lot. If they don't, they will get tossed. Interesting. Little dolly dress. What do we got here? <gasps> oh. Super Data Blaster NFL. Snap it. Oh, oh geez. Cool. 
We should Google Lens that. Uh huh. Super Data Blaster by Tiger. NFL. Flip it over. What's it tell us? Is there a year on it? Main yes, battery. Yes, 1995. Door. Cartridge cool. lock. What does that mean? Hmm. Well, we'll have to open that up yeah, yeah. and see if it's destroyed. Oh, yes. you, you wouldn't believe, Jan. I'm sorry, everyone. What just went by on my on my front boulevard. Uh, um, what do you call it? A mush mush? You know, the dogs pulling a sled? What do you call that? A dog sled? Yeah. A dog sled just went by with a guy on it. <laughs> the Canadians are strange oh, ones. Awesome. Oh my god. These little army guys them. can can oh, actually cool. be valuable, believe yes, it or they not. Can. Rhonda, it might be coming your way. I've never seen a dog sled in real life before, let alone in my little city here. Uh oh. Okay. okay. Doug's on it. He's saying NFL data blaster. Brand new in box on eBay for twenty four. Oh, well, this is definitely not brand new in box. All the more to keep in the junk drawer lot. Well, the junk drawer lot, after we go through it, is really just a toy lot. Okay. So, we got a bag full of garbage. We've got um, a couple of toys that might be valuable some seeds. I mean, this is not, I got, I got bigger fish to fry <laughs> than this oh, kind of stuff. Right. Well, thanks for indulging us. Yeah. Uh huh? Well, I got, I got that drawer cleaned out. Yes, you did. And you never know, you know? Yeah. So that can all go. That's something I won't have to trip over anymore. <laughs> that was an itty bitty elephant bite. <laughs> Brett's Still telling us what she got in her jar. She got some tours pennies, guitar picks like rings, cool, a metal tea steeping shaped like a house, two lucky pennies, itty bitty metal skull, nice, dragon, scarecrow, train, camel, turtle, donkey, and more. Sounds like you scored. Oh, Swamp Picker saying hello. Hey, Glenn. Up to the toys. People are wearing shorts up in Winnipeg? No way. Oh, we have to remind you to get the loom and the loops for Nancy. Nancy, oh, thank you. Three Sheets Marie, thank you for reminding Jan. Okay, this, this bag right here. And Christine, Christie's saying progress is progress. It is. Wouldn't be where I am if I didn't get disappointed by days that I would get distracted by a drawer full of crap. Oh, and grab the sugar grapes too, Doug is reminding. Okay. Everything okay there? Yep, I'm just transferring the toys into <laughs> one of the toy drawers. I put All the right. cars with the Leslie cars and the dinky toys. Nice. Putting my Tupperware back where I found it. Somewhere here went the top. I think it's downstairs. Okay. Now this guy, let me see here. We got a couple. Okay, so he's a small one. This this is I have been finding his pieces, parts everywhere. This is also Optimus Prime. Cool. And I've been slowly putting him back together. Now we have is he up here? 
Yes, we did, Auntie Christy, we did remind her about the water break, but PC no, reminded I don't think he goes here. She's on a mission right now. Yeah, so I'm trying to people. find Optimus Prime. Okay, well, people want to make sure you're watered and hydrated. Yeah, I need that. I need to be walked and watered. Oh, walked. Walk. Guess walk. what? Doug and Julie. What? <gasps> Smurf stuff. <laughs> Smurfs. Who's a grumpy guy? D Gargamel. I see. I, I didn't watch Smurfs. I was a oh. Smurf gal. Well, the Smurfette's Doug's, not here. Doc, Doug is happy. Yeah, because like, Doug was saying that the only thing that wasn't in this house was Smurfs. <laughs> <laughs> Wrong answer. <laughs> I don't know where Optimus Prime went, but I put his... See, here's another part that I think goes to him. Okay. And I got to find him. Piece by piece. So I think that together. these... I think. Th see? Look, the bottoms are the same. Ah, I see. So random drunk junk drawer covered in dirt yes. on the back porch. And I don't even remember where I found this piece. I mean, I got to, I got to ask, did it, you know, did she do it on purpose separating all this stuff or did, does it really happen with hoarders that c things can like get separated from? Yes, of course. I think so. Okay. I need coffee. All right. We emptied that. Yeah. That's awesome. I, well, it is. It's, you know, one, and, and you got Christmas stuff downstairs. Yep. And I got a whole bunch of uh, trips up and down the stairs with books to do, and I'll do those uh, after. But I have to, because I was troubleshooting StreamYard and then had to go buy ear pods that yeah. apparently don't work. Pardon Bless me. You. Um, I didn't get my invoices out. And Babes has everything packed. So we have to get our invoices out. I packed everything. Where's and I'm ready to invoice. You are? Yeah, everything's Julie, packed. We might invoice at the exact same time. Ooh. How cool would that be? Oh, crap, I forgot the grapes. In what about the, the loop-de-loops? I was going to say something, but I thought, nah, she's going to go hydrate. Yeah, but I'll forget. Gosh, another, a lady is walking by with two Newfoundland dogs. Does anyone know what a, they're the world's largest Don't they look kind of like huskies? No, they look like bears. They're the... New, 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 new feast. The big black dogs where their heads are like this big. Okay. Loom. And crunchy grapes. Yes. Oh, Elizabeth. Why am I getting the crunchy grapes? Uh, Doug. For Doug. Doug wants them? I assume so. <laughs> Uh, Crescent Moon is saying good There's morning. only one box of crunchy grapes. Okay, Brett thought there was more. So I'm nope. shocked. I don't see any more. Oh. There's a milk glass vase in there I forgot about. I only see one box of crunchy grapes. Oh, yeah, sorry. Um, I think Doug did, not just Brett, to be clear. Doug thinks he saw more there. Okay. Too. Well, I'll set them right here until we figure out why I'm getting crunchy grapes. Got the loom. This is a really old one, too. They tried to make reproductions of these later on. Okay. Um, out of plastic. Right. And uh, the plastic little fingers would break really easily. Oh, Noelle's back. 
Hi, Noelle. She's saying, Jan, I need some of those cabinets for my new house. Which cabinet? We're chasing coffee. Coffee's out here. And an airplane, apparently. Which cabinets? Uh, maybe the ones, I'm not sure. I think the ones in the- You want me to ship them? Hold on, camera. Front. Am I shipping cabinets? Is that what's happening? I think that's what Noelle's hoping for, maybe. I do not know. Or maybe she wants me to, because um, she's coming next summer. Oh, right. Yes, yes, yes. So. Take them home with her. Yeah, that's what she's saying. She says, I'll get them when I come this summer, silly. Okay. I hope you're bringing a covered trailer. Yeah. <laughs> Probably. Well, I know she got the hookup on her CRV, just like I have. Nice. So that she can tug. Okay, so Doug is saying, if you have more than one box, I think I want them, he's saying. Okay, I think I only have one box, but I will look. This is not your spot. Nobody's supposed to be in front of the microwave door stopping me from heating up my cold coffee. So you two elephants are in timeout. And you, Mr. Lead Crystal Vase... You need to get sold because you're going to get broken. Okay, got to put the got to put the okay. keys in the keys spot. Brett saying Julie Smurf and Jan, PC and Doug and I, so three people, not just Brett, all believe we remember seeing more than one box of the grapes. Okay. And, and they're not talking about remember seeing today. They're talking about they remember when we went through that room, we found no more idea. crunchy grapes. Is that what you're saying? Don't know. Let's get some clarification from Brett. That's one thing I need to do at some point. Or if somebody is, if somebody is still um, watching. Yes, Mad Zabinga, my eBay store is up. Yes. Correct. If some saying. if somebody is watching um, some of the videos still, the older videos, the working lives, we need descriptions in those badly. Yeah, so Brett is for the room that saying, we're in. Yes. Um, definitely from before and Doug saying yes, it was a long yeah. time ago. Yeah, a long Day time ago. Julie saying, hello. Hi, Day Trip Julie. Day Trip Julie, you should have seen a box of rib ribbons that oh, yeah. Jan, Jan's going to have in her sale this Wednesday night. Peekaboo Peek box on Wednesday. All right, let me put... Uh, Noelle saying she just sent a bunch of vintage long gloves out in a free gift box. Nice. Noelle is enjoying being Santa right now. She's yeah. sending boxes everywhere. Yeah. Okay, Jack and Piper saying, when you cleaned out that room and finally made it to the window, I think there were grapes in that room. Okay, so definitely multiple grapes. There is a link to my eBay store. Yes, day trip, Julie. It was the first thing she'll, maybe she'll show you. It was like uh, two rows of five, maybe. All Really? Wasn't it? So we got to go back up there and look. Oh, the grapes, you mean? Yeah, because, okay. you know, you got to gotta sell it when, when, it's, when it's hot. When it's fresh in everybody's mind. Yes. Um, what else was I, oh, the other thing that I was going to post, um, after I go home and do invoices, here comes the dog sled again. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's like squirrel. so weird. Squirrel. Okay. Keep going. Say dog it again. Sled. 
<laughs> okay. Uh, slag glass tulip pendant lamps. Yes. I want to get those listed because those will actually fit in, depending on the diameter, Babe said 12 by 12 by 12 boxes or 14 by 14 by 14 boxes. So those would be good ones to ship because we stock those boxes. Cool. Oh, that is good coffee. Just not hot enough. Don right. Wright saying, I always make fun of paper Goy and Mr. Magazine's Rochester accent. So it wouldn't be fair if I left you. I know. Right, Don? I love her accent. I There's love no it. Oh, accent. You oh, guys are goofy. So cool. And and Don, I don't know if you know Dee from Thrill of the Thrift. She's also got that Western New York accent. Yeah, but hers is more uh No, it's like yours. Really? 100%. Well, she's in she's in New York too. You know that. Yes, she's in Niagara she's, Falls. Yep, Niagara Falls, New York. All right, sugared, sugared grapes. Everyone's giving you a clap saying 22 items in your eBay store. Yes! And there was more. I sold five. I That's sold right. five items already. All right. <laughs> I think I, it must just be a Canadian thing. Doug doesn't hear an accent. And it's because he's in Pennsylvania. And Farm Grove Scavenger does not hear an accent. Evan yeah, has no accent, so it's just to the Canadian ear, I guess. Okay. Looking. Noelle is, uh, she bought a 12 gallon coat of, I'm not sure, I think it's gloves for five bucks in the summer before last. I've sold and sold and sold and sold them like crazy. 30 to $50 a pair. Very nice. Brett saying, holy crow, who owns a 12-gallon tote full? Do I need to propose to them as well? Wait, do they have lovely handkerchiefs? <laughs> oh, and Nessie says she's in Florida or in uh, California. She doesn't hear an accent either. That's yeah. interesting. There's no accent. You guys there are totally goofy. Is. There totally well, isn't. The, all my Canadian people like my husband and my best 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 friend they go oh my god listen to her accent yeah yeah that's you guys <laughs> you guys are the oddballs out <laughs> i don't see any more boxes of sugared grapes without really oh, digging it. around the diameter of this room <laughs> elizabeth says you both have accents but julie's is stronger <laughs> that's yes see she has an Australian accent. Elizabeth's in Australia. Oh, yeah. I love listening to Elizabeth. Yeah, I don't see any more boxes of sugared grapes. Oh, and Noelle has a 12-gallon tote of handkerchiefs, handkerchiefs, not chips, also for Brett. Nice. Load her up. Yeah, I don't John's see. Saying, since we have ten percent of the U.S. population, I guess we are the odd ones out. We are Don. Strength mm -hmm. in numbers, Don. I have to look at oh, another. Yeah, time. another Canadian, Jack and Piper. She's saying, "I'm with you. I hear it, but D's is much stronger." <laughs> <laughs> Accent is strong with that one. Julie is saying, I had someone ask me where I was from at one of my lives. I guess my California accent was coming through. That's cool. California has an accent? I, I didn't know that. I probably want a Canadian in her live show hearing an accent. <laughs> uh, Noelle saying she's not going to sell the handkerchiefs to Brett. No? No. There we go. What's she going to do with them? Just I'm send them sure. to Brett? Maybe, yeah. Well, she no, just says she no, says no you cannot. cannot have them. Yeah. You're oh, summarizing Angel. what she wrote. I did. No, Ethel, you cannot have them. Sorry. PC, who's in Poland, saying we all have accents. 
<laughs> yeah. Oh, PC, you're cute. Oh, Kai here. Oh, Julie, do you have a Valley Girl accent? Like, girl. oh my God. Oh, totally. Julie does not talk like that. <laughs> Depends on what has been triggered. Uh, oh, that's cute, Julie. I'm going to check and see if I've got Miss uh, Kim Murphy's information. Elizabeth Mackey saying, so true that I do have an accent. My Canadian friend Judy, who lives here now, says I have a very strong, broad Aussie accent that she often doesn't understand. Whoa. I don't see... <laughs> Julie Miss Kim Murphy. Julie Daytrip is saying about the um, Valley Girl. She goes, maybe that was it, Christy. Oh, my God. <laughs> like, oh, my God. Oh, my God. Yeah, I don't see. I don't have um, info for Miss Kim Murphy. So if she's still here. Oh, she then... says, I will send my info now, Jan. It's she's Kim Curly. Curly. Hey, yep. Yeah. I definitely don't have it then. Curl. Nope. Yep. I just wanted to make sure that I I forget stuff. I have yes. to write notes. Okay. So we got so the we got the this, pot holders. This was our listing party yesterday. Oh, right. Yeah, last night. Yeah. That was fun. On, I want to do on that Noelle's again. Noelle's channel. You yes. can check it out on Noelle's channel. But I definitely didn't get as many listings done as I do when it's just Julie and I. Um, not live. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the most that happens when Julie and I are doing FaceTime together or whatever <laughs> is, uh, you know, we start singing Christmas songs or yeah. we start swearing at Alexa to see yeah. what she'll do. And yes. Yeah. <laughs> so it's definitely a bit of a distraction to host a listing show. Yeah, I agree. But it was fun. Yes. Blue rhinestone earrings and brooches. I can't see that far away. Uh, Goody Ma's letting farm girl scavenger know what she likes. Blue, uh, like blue rhinestones, earrings, brooches, and pink and clear and green, etc. Well, I would have to say that they have the same taste since they were bidding against each other. Oh, for what? For that uh, jewelry lot. Oh. Yeah, Brett. Ooh, I got a note from Miss Pat. Brett, your eleven-year-old niece says everything like a question. It goes up at the end. Well, you know there are a lot of adults that talk like that, and it's interesting that they do. Ooh, Miss Pat gave me ideas for what theme to do. Oh. Is it his top secret surprise? Um, yeah. Vintage toys, mostly mm -hmm. smalls. Okay. I don't think I want to do that in a live sale. I think I would okay. rather that really old toys be listed. <coughs> a huge capital letters doll sale. Doing a box lot sale again. Vintage baby clothes. And she's been thinking about a Victorian 20s lady clothes or a book sale. Hmm. Mm. I don't know. Because let's see, this Wednesday, where's my, how do I get a calendar on a Mac? For the love. See, on a computer, you can just click on the clock and instantly get a calendar. What's new in calendar? Continue. Okay, here we go. So this Wednesday is December 1st, which is going to be Christmas crap with Noel. Yes. So then if I sell with Pat on December 8th, that might be, I don't think, I don't know, people will be in the Christmas mode. 
but probably won't be purchasing things for Christmas. What you know, day we, is that? December 8th. You never know. Julie, day trip, is. I'm going to confirm that this Wednesday coming, Julie, is going to be Christmas crap. Christmas crap. crap Christmas, Christmas crap. crap. We're it's selling gonna vintage be some Christmas. Christmas crap. And it's with Noel, Farm Girl Scavenger, and Jan. Yeah. Roaring 20s sale. About to be 22. Oh, good point. What's that? So if, if it would be an antique sale, if uh, Pat did a Roaring Twenties sale, because it's about to be 2022. Okay. So everything would literally be antique, not vintage. Uh, to be antique, it's 100 years old. Right. So it's right. 2022 is coming. 1920. Okay, gotcha. So she's you got it? Up from 19 yeah, sorry. It's girl math. It's okay. I, I'm not good at it. That's okay. <laughs> totally, totally not good at it. All right. So I did not, let's see. Okay, Julie's got a suggestion. Do New Year's glam barware like that. Ooh. Very, very, very good idea, Julie. Me Ooh. likey. Me likey. I wonder if I, I mean, I got cool bottles. C bottles, canteens, you know, that kind of stuff. Bottles, fancy bottles that you could like re-pour your liquor in. I don't know if that's allowed. Hey, I don't know. Good, uh, yeah. Um, uh, Annie Christie saying, Yeah, New Year's Eve sale on December 8th, glitz and glam. I like that. Hmm. And actually, I'm in that hop sale that Beth Sweet Treats and Pretties is doing December 7th, and I think that is what I'm going to do then because I don't know if my stuff would get there from Canada for Christmas, so yeah, I really like that and Rhonda was had a question in what is what is cut off for your shipping from your area Jen to reach certain places for Christmas gifts like what is I don't the, know okay somebody somebody uh anybody should that's shipping should be able to answer that except for me because I don't pay attention okay Julie saying her uh her true story came. Barb are doing that theme this Friday. I think it's great because people may be moving off Christmas by then. Yeah, good thinking. Yeah. Well, I tried moving off Christmas um, a couple weeks ago, and it was like crickets. <laughs> yeah. So I was like, okay, we'll bring Christmas. Back. Yeah, no. I want to do um, a clear glass sale. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, badly. Hey, Jan. Hmm. Do you have that picture, that beautiful crystal picture handy? Yeah, look at that, you guys. Look what Jan found. Look at the sawtooth rim on it at the top. Isn't it's gorgeous. That gorgeous? And it's got daisies on it, mm -hmm. right? I think that we're calling those daisies. Well, it needs to be washed. Yeah, but it's but beautiful. But there is no chips, no cracks, and it is, it's gorgeous. It's all, and it's got like um, little hash marks in the mm -hmm. in the sides, it, like finger. Yeah, grips. It. I think it could be bohemian. I just want to throw that out there and see what Brett and Noel think. Yeah, I did. I did find um, with Google Lens a couple of them, but it's very clear that the ones that I found, they have no idea what it is either. I mean, they're calling it sunflowers. They're calling it American glass. They're calling it Polish glass. They're calling it German glass. Okay. So the source, you can find this out there. You just can't find, you can't figure out which one's right. Everyone's loving that. Um, Noelle's asking you to send her a couple of good pictures later. Okay. Yeah. I've got, there's a lot of lead crystal here and you know, it, it's, I think it's beautiful. I, I love 
Um, this one's Makasha. Oh, yeah. Yes, Makasa. Yes. I mean, there is some gorgeous, gorgeous clear glass stuff here. And, uh, yeah, I would love to do a clear glass sale. And I was doing research on clear glass, and some of it is doing really well on eBay. Mm. Um, there was some crystal crystal goblets that I found um, that will do well. And there's... Okay, there's your deadlines right there. December Pat 15th. Is, okay. She's on it. Pat. Good girl. To the rescue. I have no idea. If, I don't think it's Princess House, Barb. No. Princess House is... I've never... Uh, I have a prince, Princess House set. In fact, I should sell that because it's all still new in box. It's never been oh. out of the box. Ooh, perfect. Yeah, I, I should sell that. That's well, at my house. Go. Um, people, you know, the night, <gasps> Amy, rock star. That's what, what I'm going to do. <gasps> yes. I'll write that down. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That'll be fun. Yeah. Good job. Good job. Yes. I'm going to do, I'm going to do a pre-recorded clear glass sale. And at the same time, so the pre-recorded sale will help me get dimensions and pictures and comp them. And then I can do the pre-recorded sale on my channel. And if people don't want to go after the clear glass and I could do the fairy lights. Cause I got that cool light up thing that I got from the meow house. <laughs> I love it. Remind I love that stupid is. thing. Let's see the stupid thing. It's it's my favorite toy that I got from that house, other than the Princess Bowl Pyrex set. Very good uh, idea. Great idea. Happy days to say. Okay, hold on. And Pretty Ma saying, sure sounds better than listing on eBay at Evan Owen. Ooh. Is that cool? Yeah, be cooler if the lights are out. Well, yeah, show us. Come okay, on. hold on. Let me set it up. I love that little toy. <laughs> and I have tons of little boxes of mini LED lights. Holy crap, nice. the thing turns. I didn't know it turned. Oh. Ooh, spooky. <gasps> oh, doesn't see? that show off clear glass? Yes, I agree. But you know what? I think a, a LED, just white light, might do even better. But that is very cool. Andy Christie saying you could put. Those flashing ice cubes in it too. Nice. Yeah, I love this. Pretty. I love this little thing. That very little cool. thing is really cool. That was uh I think it has a couple of settings too. Nice. Maybe that's the non spinny setting. I don't know. I love that goofy thing. But that would be um because it's, it's hard. Julian, you and I were talking about it the other day because I looked at um, your auctions that you had up. Yeah. And you, some of your older auctions, which were clear glass, mm. um, you had done great pictures yeah, <coughs> with so them because you can't, you can't do a white background for clear glass. No, I used the black Bristol board. Yeah. Oh, yes, definitely. Definitely. Jewelry hasn't been on the top of my mind, mainly because um, it's already moved. I'm, I'm ultra focused because the barn is in progress. Oh, I didn't tell you guys. He over, 
he overestimated, he transposed a number with, uh, with the measurement on the barn. So it's not almost $4,000. It's a little over $3,000. Well, that's good. So that's way better. Um, yes. Uh, Brett's saying gray or tan is better than, uh, black yeah. background. Yeah. But there's, I mean, there's so much cool stuff that you can do with clear glass. I don't know if diving down that rabbit hole is the best idea right now. For identification, yeah, I'm doing research and everything. It's almost like it, that would be one to maybe when George comes over, just to have him look at it. To, I, he'll probably be able to identify like the older um, early American stuff. Mm -hmm. Well, with a little work, I can identify it too. It's just a matter of I probably shouldn't squirrel away and I should stay focused on uh, listing the the new in box stuff and and what I'm doing right now and stay focused on the lamps. But that uh, but I'm definitely going to do that down the road. Yes. And Noelle, if you look there, she's saying maybe we can delve into the clear glass when I come this summer. Yeah. Yeah, we could do that, too. I don't, I don't know where we will be in the process as of summer. It, we are putting our expectations awfully high to try to have this place up for sale by the end of the summer. Um, because the barn is, I mean, it, it's, it's going steadily, but mm -hmm. the, yeah. Mad Zambinga has an idea for sale, too. Yeah, that's a good idea. Yep, kitchenware and stuff like that. It, see, it's a little bit different with live sales because you really have to... I have a pretty good idea of my viewers. I mean, if I'm a guest on another channel, it's totally different. Like, Misty's sale was like... Oh, my that gosh. Was awesome. That was awesome. You that know, was big time. That was big time. But she had, you know, at one point, there was like 400 people watching. Ah, and time. they're used to... Um, what she sells. So in they're buying it. So going onto her channel to sell that stuff um, would do better um, than a live sale on my channel, because I know I have a pretty good idea of what most of the people that regularly follow me and regularly come to my sales like. Um, but it, it's just like, you know, that live sale a couple weeks ago was a good reminder. You know, it wasn't the <laughs> this i gotta hear oh boy i hope so oh i hope so that would be so cool that would be so cool <laughs> oh don wants hey, to don, see yeah yeah she okay might be able to help out i think it, i have a feeling it's um check bohemian and like I said, we found uh, lots of, I, I found it. it, it was not difficult to find with Google Lens, um, but people, they're all over the map with what it actually is. Show her the um, handle and show her the uh, sawtooth on the, on the rim. And then the There's divots the in the flowers. handle. More profile there. If they give it. Dead it on I'm backwards. Let me turn the camera yeah. around. Okay, that's way easier. Oh, Elizabeth saying bye. Bye, Elizabeth. Bye, Elizabeth Mackey. <laughs> you have a verse in the song. Oh. Oh, yeah. Oh, dear. You okay. missed, You got to go back in the in the chat of of last night when we were doing our listing live, Julie. Okay. I mean, people were, they were like, you, you have a lot to answer to because you had that song stuck in everybody's head. Oh dear. 
Show yeah, and the starburst bottom. Can we see that again? It's very good quality. Very good quality. Nice cut. Yep, it's all cut glass. Oh, and is there a seam? I don't think there is. Because the handle you can see is has been attached. There is no seam. And the handle is applied. Yeah. Yeah, and she's saying, agreeing it's cut. Yeah, and this, you can see that this is like, this was smoothed right here. At first, from a distance, it looked like bubbles, but they're actually... Uh, like, yeah, little divots to hold. Yeah, divots. And it's got that... Yeah. Hi, Julia. Hey, Julia. <laughs> Amy, she had it stuck in her head all day, and oh, she wasn't even doing Christmas stuff. <laughs> Candy, I had floor. to jump on my laptop watching on my TV. Dean Bob Seeger came to mind. Just take that old, just take that old Christmas crap off the shelf. So I'm this thing is, <laughs> is almost six pounds by itself. <laughs> That's hilarious. Those are good lyrics, Candy A. Look at those, Dean. I don't know. I'll figure it out eventually. Oh. <laughs> Dean, Dean like I knew you'd like that deanery. Uh, I missed it. It was the lyrics to uh, here. Hang on, stand by. So to the tune of uh, "Old Rock and Roll" by Bob Seger. Yeah, let's hear it. Her lyrics are. Just take that old Christmas crap off the shelf. I'm trying to list and sell them by myself. Nice. <laughs> Good phrasing, Candy A. Good phrasing. <laughs> we can't get copyright strikes for that if we change the words. No. Oh, I'm glad to hear that, Julia. Uh oh, She's, they've happened? all been really sick. Oh no. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, I'm glad you're feeling better, Julia. Yeah, Dawn, that's the type of thing that, you know, once down the road, once we start moving the contents of this place because I'm I'm not in in any rush. I mean, I am in a rush, but I'm not in a rush, you know, because my priority is honoring my mom and the decision that I made was to learn this stuff. Why I decided to do that, I, I mean, I, I think it's because, I think it's mostly out of guilt because I I always thought it was junk. You know what I mean? And I think that um, the biggest show of respect that I can show my mom is for her to be proven right because she really loved being right. So that type of stuff. So I think down the road, once we start um, moving everything and it's all in one place and we get this place listed for sale, that's when I really want to do some deep dives into the really valuable stuff. Awesome, Jan. Yeah. I mean, right now, if I can, if I can find a comp for it, then, you know, it's, I've done my job. It's, it was much harder on my mom because she was terrible with computers. Um, so that's why, you know, she bought resource books and stuff like that. And hers was all through conversation and, uh, you know, reading magazines, thrifting type magazines and stuff like that. But um, it wasn't as easy. There wasn't a Google lens. No. When yeah. my mom was selling. Um, it, it's. I, I don't know if things would have been different mm. if there was. I mean, but she was never computer savvy at yeah. all. 
So, yeah. All right. Julie Smurf, I've got to go send all my invoices for my sale because Babes has been taking slow uh, intervals of standing and packing on his bad knee and he's got everything packed up. So everything is ready to invoice. And I did not get that done before the live today. Okay. Yeah, that's right, Brett. She's oh, I don't saying, feel guilty anymore. I don't, I don't, I'm, I'm all, she's getting, she's getting a, a great big kick out of this. I told you so. I literally can, I know it sounds weird. I literally can hear her snickering half the time that I'm in this house. <laughs> so she's, she's really enjoying what I'm doing. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it. All right. Miss Julie, okay. thank you for coming with me. And StreamYard is going to yes. get back to me, hopefully. Yes, about and, this uh, whole sound thing. Yeah, I don't, if anybody else knows anything, if you're still watching at the end of this or you're watching this on rerun, the problem that I'm having is ever since, uh, so I don't know if it was the iOS update to 15.1 on my iPhone or if it was the major uh, StreamYard update. but. I haven't tested it with somebody that doesn't have any permissions on my channel, but ever since then for both of those things, um, it doesn't go, it doesn't go speaker yeah. it, and it's the only, th only stream yard. Everything else on my phone is fine. FaceTime yeah. calls, Facebook messenger, Instagram messenger, playing something. I even went to like a micro microphone test website at the recommendation of stream yard. Wow. And um, yeah, every everything but StreamYard. And on the mobile version, hmm, I'll have to think about that. Anyway, the mobile version on iOS for StreamYard, there is no selection for speakers. So you can't like change okay. like you can on a computer. On a computer, you can, you know, uh, you can do plugged in speakers, you can do a Bluetooth speaker, you can do your computer speaker or whatever. You have the option to change what speaker it does. Um, that option does not exist on the mobile iOS version of StreamYard. So, yeah, tech anything is annoying, especially, you know, when I'm technical and I lost an hour and a half of today yeah. doing it. I oh yeah, go go back and rewatch. And we were we were live listing uh Julie on uh Noel's channel last night. Yes. We only got two done each. I got three. <laughs> Little too too many shenanigans. I got three. Oh. Oh, Julie's <coughs> wow. send me that message. Which one? The about the about Menor? the little the yeah that thing it's on the okay. it's in my dining room on the okay. shelf. Noel put it together. Okay. <coughs> All right, guys, I'm signing off. Gotta go do invoices. I will Julia see you guys. Julia perfecting pearls get better soon. Yes, I will see you guys Wednesday night, eight p.m. Eastern, selling vintage Christmas crap with, with Noel. Noel. Farm Girl Scavenger. And then, Gonna of course, we'll be back here on Sunday, too. Oh, Noelle knows the answer. What is it, Noelle? What is that thing? That thing that you put all the pieces together. Do, 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 do. do, do. You oh, told me told last you. week. Yeah. Gone. Don't remember. Okay. Well, she, hopefully she'll tell me again. Yeah. <laughs> and not hopefully. be mad that she already told yeah. me. I, I it yeah. it escapes stuff stuff goes. But then I can remember that, you know, a little blue piece of plastic on the floor is yeah. the What's up with that? end side to a Connect <laughs> Four game. Don't ask. Uh, oh, it's German. Oh, yeah, I don't remember this conversation. I think I remember seeing a picture in the messenger of it assembled. 
So I think it's in the messenger. I think I could be okay. wrong. I, okay. I might have dreamt it. Okay. All right. I'll send you pictures, Lulu, and you can help me figure it out. Apparently it's German, not Jewish. Whoops. <laughs> All right. <laughs> We're signing off. Julie, I'll catch you later. Bye. Bye, guys.